Well, I'm a mom, so um, I always relate to that part of a character. Although I'm not not the kind of mom Charlene was, I do relate to uh, wanting to be a good mom, which I believe Charlene probably wanted to be at some point, even though she made a lot of poor choices. She was human and wanted to be glamorous and wanted to be so many things. Um, and she fell short in so many ways, but I, I relate to that part of her um, wanting to be everything and then falling short. I loved playing this character of Charlene. First of all, I have to hand it to my hair team who created this phenomenal wig, just brought Charlene to life. And then the makeup team was phenomenal. Just like researching the makeup from the period and just making slight little tweaks. And I mean, those, those people, that team was across the board phenomenal. And then the wardrobe team, you know, really getting these incredible costumes. So that really, really helped me um, transform. And that's what I wanted. That's what I was so excited about um, with this character was being able to just sort of Kim have Kim disappear and Charlene emerge. And I felt like with the team around me and the support and the script um, that that was able to happen. Anna Redmond showed up in my house in Franklin, Tennessee with a, a ton of fantastic vintage items um, that I immediately loved. Anna's phenomenal and the, the stock that she had, the options that she had were just amazing. Some of them were original vintage pieces and some of them they built from scratch. And um, the wardrobe was so important for this character. And we talked about wanting Charlene to be glamorous because that was something that was really important to her was, was looking right, having her nails done, her lipstick on and, and looking presentable. Um, and so Anna really got that and, um, and added so much to Charlene. I think the production value in this film is incredible the history, the music, uh, the storytelling is wonderful. I mean, to me, it feels like we've just been dropped into a moment in history. And um, so it's nostalgic in a lot of ways. Um, and then at the core of it also is a really compelling journey of someone with a really broken life and a broken heart, finding faith, finding love, finding wholeness. Um, as, as he goes along, and that's a beautiful story. I love every single look. I love all of these looks for Charlene, but I will say the first dress that I appear in in the film, in the bar, Charlene is in her prime. She's, you know, she was very charming. So she's just like got people around her and she feels great. And they had me in this gorgeous, gorgeous dress that they built from scratch. That's like this um, silky, um, tapestry with like a floral pattern on it and just the way it's cut and like some pearls. I thought that was phenomenal. Also when they head to California, I love these like head scarves. So when we head to California, I love that old fashioned tie under the chin look. Those are two of my favorites. <laughs>